welcome back to my channel yay <laughs> all right so if you're new here what is to do don't forget to click that subscribe button and turn on your notification so you don't miss a video from me yay <laughs> all right so today is an exciting day woohoo <laughs> guess whose birthday is today me <laughs> i can't believe i'm turning i'm uh not i'm turning i, I can't believe i've turned 26 today 26 oh my gosh <sighs> close to 30 hmm not looking forward to 30 <laughs> but yeah so uh today is an exciting day so i'm gonna go to georgia aquarium it's my first time going to georgia aquarium so yay i'm excited i'll be meeting up with my friend alicia so i'll see you guys when i get there bye see you later Thank you. 
who may be able to identify body pairs. They're often seen cleaning each other. This helps birds clean and arrange feathers in areas they cannot reach, and they have a little scratching the birds with one breath. If you see a female in this habitat that doesn't have the characteristic black and white plumage, you may have spotted a juvenile pair. Juvenile feathers are shades of gray, with a lighter belly and chest. Penguins maintain their juvenile feathers for about a year after reflection, and they mold into their adult plumage. If you're curious about whether a penguin is male or female, just take a look at the identification beads on their flipper-like wings. If the female closest to the chest is clear, the bird is male. That's a female. I'm like 
Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, for the safety of our performers and the enjoyment of all our guests, no photography or videography of any kind is allowed during the presentation. Once the presentation begins, it is important that no one walks along the aisle at the front of the pool. Movement near the acrylic windows is distracting to the audience and can affect the performance of the show. Please allow 